this whole video thing is traumatizing, fam. Where am I looking? Am I looking at me or am I looking at the camera? Take four, because, right, I've just been a complete nonce and I have recorded this vertically three times over. What's up, everybody? What's up, y'all motherfuckers? So right now, I'm gonna go outside and I've just done recorded this again, upside down. Essentially, once again, I'm gonna walk you through a day in recovery for me. That being my calorie intake, my macronutrient intake, which may or may not be on point. I'm not great with the macronutrients, or with like sticking to it every day. Sometimes I have way too many carbs. Sometimes I have way, like way too little protein, too much protein, too much fat, whatever. Trying to stick to that basic guideline. It seems to be working at the minute. I'm watching a lot of educational content on sources such as Shredded Sports Science. I think he's quite good. Jess Cavalier is good for exercises and other things. Those would be two main guys that I'm watching at the minute. Luke watches a lot of Festuvian, is it Festuvian Physiques? Um, but anyway, essentially, right, so I'm starting the day with a Ganoderma infused slash racing infused black coffee. Um, and that's gonna be to settle, to reduce inflammation and also for immune boosting properties. Little taste, it is lovely. I'm just drinking it black, you can drink it with milk, sugar, water, whatever. Um, and then I'm having a Baraka orange flavor because it's tasty as fuck in the morning. The Ganoderma coffee, about 10, 10 calories for the cup. Baraka about six lemon water irrelevant but it's just water with a little bit of lemon juice in it and um, just to make it taste good and then for breakfast is a big bowl of fruit which is just chopped like the size of it yeah there's a quarter pineapple in here there's two strawberries or three strawberries one banana and a big orange that box roughly contains 300 plus calories and we'll just stick with the calories on the box because i haven't checked the uh the macro but it has a lot of vitamin c and all that jazz uh, I like having it in the morning anyway, especially on this recovery day. I can eat it throughout. I'd say I'll be eating this for an hour or two. I'm um, just picking on it, going outside. I'm gonna go outside, I'm gonna do a yoga session now um, and chill out in that sunny weather that you can see. Well, relatively sunny. It looks way sunnier there, but it ain't that funny. But I'm gonna chill out. Uh, might need to put a top on. can't believe I didn't record any of that again. Like, fucking right motherfuckers, take number fucking four. Um, I'm two hours done my stretching session. Um, it was only a small session outside, my mobility is clearly lacking today. Yeah, the knee's kind of sore, or like the outside of the knee just from the running. Um, Muscle-wise, not the actual knee itself. And just that insertion of the quad and the ankles are kind of gone, dorsiflexion-wise. But at the minute I am now making my lunch second slash third second meal of the day and um, it's like half two or something three o'clock which is pasta and pesto with cheese so i'm gonna have a bowl of that i've been studying for the past hour and a half because i got me fucking exam final exam tomorrow i've been studying for that and i during that time i ate half a packet of sesame seeds and half a packet of um chili nuts which equated to like five something, 500 something. Um, and this bowl, I think of peso is gonna be around 700 cows. So I'm up on like 1,500 so far once I finish this. And I'm probably not gonna eat for a few hours, we'll see. And then I'll have food, I'll have my dinner, which I think will be a chicken stir fry. So we'll get on it. Did that, I recorded that the wrong way once again, but we have for snack number two of the day, um, yeah, snack number two, meal number two. That'll be the fourth thing we're eating today is I'm gonna have like 80 grams of hummus, 
and two pit of red. So that's 202 calories, and then this is about 150 calories, so like 350 ish. And yeah, and that puts my calories to like 1,900, and then I'm gonna have my dinner. So I'd say it's gonna be a fairly calorific day, but sure. Recovery in that G. Olapitos, motherfuckers. Um, it is chicken stir fry time. I'm just about to make my chicken stir fry. I got my beans um, and my pea shoots. And uh, I got my six breasts of chicken from Sherlock Fletcher out in um, Ballister. But I'm not gonna eat the six, obviously, because I'm not a fucking beast. I'm not Eddie Hall or none of those motherfuckers. My left lap from that run, I don't know why. I tried to do a few push-ups and I was going to do pull-ups outside as like an active recovery, like do your stuff, you know? I did another yoga session, then I did push-ups, and then I went, got onto the bar and even with the resistance band, I fucking, whatever, that, that left lat was just spasming. So I decided to do bicep curls instead and I'm just gonna relax that for a few days. Um, put some deep heat on it, and then some pure athlete bomb, which I'm gonna use, um, which the mother has in stock. So, good luck, son. We'll see you with this beautiful fucking food. We got the turmerics and the chili flakes and the teriyaki. Vlog one. Um, hopefully that compilation, like. Uh, Thing that I have mapped montage in my head with the food has come out as planned. I tallied up the calories, so it's roughly 1,500 calories for this dinner. That's including sauce like hoisin, um, hoisin soy sauce, and olive oil. The oil is so calorific, bro. I'm gonna serve this up, and then I'm going to we stretch and session before bed, go to sleep, and that concludes my recovery day. And then we back at it tomorrow. Um, not at recovery, obviously. Um, let me know how you felt about these. This lighting, fam. Boom. Let me know how you felt about these videos. Do you like all my bottles too? I'm an enthusiast. Um, yeah, let me know how you felt about this video, if it helps. If there's anything you wanna go more in depth on, such as like the, uh, if it's like healthy cooking or whatever. And remember, this was all my, just my experience. Not saying this is the optimal way to recover. Um, this is what I like doing, just, just how the day went. I would have liked to move a bit more today, but unfortunately I have my final exam tomorrow and I was just doing study all day, so half sitting in my arse. The totally calorie, um, total, totally, the totally calorie intake of the day was roughly like 2,750-ish, simply because I made that meal for three people, so I mean, the whole thing tallies up to like 3,000 some. Um, so I'm gonna say about 2,750 calories, which is happy enough for me. That is uh, that is a few hundred calories extra than I'd usually take. So perfect on my recovery day. Continue with your fucking scrolling, brothers. Um, so thanks guys. Stay fit, stay happy, stay healthy, motherfuckers.